Good morning, Eagles. Please stand for our morning prayer. Today is Wednesday, November 1st, 2023. Today we celebrate the Solemnity of All Saints. Beginning today and throughout the entire month of November, we will say the names of and pray for our fallen Eagles, the faculty, staff, students, and alumni of Santa Margarita who have died. Today we pray for those from the class of 1991, Ronald Stovall, Adine Pulowski robbins Chaz Goble, Angela Califano, and Allison Wilson. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. We hear in today's first reading, after this I had a vision of a great multitude which no one could count. From every nation, race, people, and tongue, they stood before the throne and before the Lamb, wearing white robes and holding palm branches in their hands. They cried out in a, vo in a loud voice, Salvation comes from our God, who is seated on the throne, and from the Lamb. Let us pray. We give glory and praise to you, Lord, for today, for reminding us that it is possible to be holy and be included in the multitude of saints. Have mercy as Lord, and forgive us our transgressions and sins. We ask you, Lord, to always guide our hearts and to always choose what is right and pleasing to you. Guide us also, Lord, on how to share your love to those who are in need that we may imitate the saints who we celebrate today. We ask this through Christ our Lord, amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. St. Margaret Mary, pray for us. Now please remain standing for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning and happy Wednesday, Eagles. On today's show, we have a word with the week from ASL, an entertainment report from Sammy, and Dancing with the Eagles walk on. Halloween is over, so now it's time to get in the Thanksgiving spirit. Um, hold on, Baron. I think it's pretty much time for Christmas songs and decorations because it's basically already Christmas. No, 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 no. Cut, cut the Christmas music. It's November 1st, not December 1st. It's still Christmas season. But. I oh. What's up, Eagles? I'm Baron Stamer. And I'm Gabby Blanche. Now, Baron, since you don't, didn't know that it's Christmas season, I'm assuming you need a refresher on the announcements as well? Yes, you're right. Today is a special mass schedule for All Saints Day. You will need to attend mass with your period seven class. We have a $10,000 scholarship opportunity for Eagles. If you are curious about the universe and desire to understand and it better through STEM, philosophy, literature, and re or religion, Submit your essay answering the scholarship prompt on bulldog.org. And reminding you all again, Hannah's on Campus Lunch Service will be closed on 11-3 and 11-6. Food trucks, Trace Compost, and TK Burger will be on campus serving lunch during these days. Students looking for service opportunities can check the Christian Service Channel and their Campus Life teams. Opportunities are updated at the start of each month, meaning today. Now with the announcements in the books, I think it's time that we hear um, ASL's word of the week. Maybe it's past the turkey. Or Merry Christmas. Hi, my name's Emma, and today I'm gonna be teaching you numbers one through 20. For one through five, your hand is facing you. So one, two, three, four, and five and then the rest are facing away. So six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. Now I can count to 20 in Spanish and ASL. And I'm just counting down the days until Santa comes. Well, maybe you can stop counting for a minute because Sammy is here with an entertainment report. Good morning, Santa Margarita Eagles. I am Sammy Borsolino here with your entertainment update. To start things off, Five Nights at Freddy's, the iconic horror game, finally has its own movie. The film adaptation was released October 27th in all theaters. The movie follows Mike Schmidt, a struggling security guard who is working hard to regain custody of his little sister, Abby. 
He accepts an offer to work at the abandoned Freddy Fazbear's Pizza and discovers that the restaurant closed down in the 1980s after five children went missing. During his third night shift, the infamous animatronics come to life. Freddy, Foxy, Bonnie, Chica, and Mr. Cupcake. Fun fact, these are not just people in suits, some are actual animatronics. Moving on, the classic Hunger Games movie series has a new addition. The Hunger Games The Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes highlights the start of the Hunger Game activities, starring Tom Blythe, Rachel Ziegler, and Peter Dinklage. 18-year-old Cornelia Snow is assigned to mentor Lucy Gray Bayer, District 12's female tribute. Uniting their instincts for showmanship, Lucy Gray and Snow work to survive and ultimately reveal who is a songbird and who is a snake. It seems that this movie is going to be great, especially if you liked the first Hunger Games movies. It will release Friday, November 17th. Well, Eagles, that's all I got for you today. I'm Sammy Borsellino, sending it back to Gabby and Baron. That was great, Sammy. Yes, thank you. And now it's time to move on to our Dancing with the Eagles walk on. What's up, SM? I'm Abby Schaff, and I'm joined by two of our dancers for Dancing with the Eagles. I'm here with... Nikki Garofalo. Bella Gissendanner. So, Nikki, explain Dancing with the Eagles for viewers who might not know what it is. So, basically, it's kind of like Dancing with the Stars. We're going to have um, one dancer from the dance program and one athlete, and they're going to be competing in front of a panel of judges, including Mrs. Wood, and we're going to be competing to win. And how confident would you say you are in your dancing skills? I'm pretty confident in my dancing skills. I feel like Nikki as a dancer and as a teacher, I'm feeling more confident every day and I'm super excited to get out there and dance. Okay, last question. How have you been working together to prepare? So we've been practicing a lot. I mean, Bella's like very naturally gifted as a dancer, so it's not very hard for us to get our choreography down and we're really excited to win. Thank you guys, sending it back to the host. That was amazing. It was indeed. Well, Gabby, I believe it is done o'clock, so we have to conclude our show. Well, Eagles, I'm Baron Stamer. And I'm Gabby Blanche. Have a good start to your winter season, Eagles.